The next match we have is the London Lillipups versus the Boston Basculins. It's the War of Alliterations here tonight. All right. Oh, we got the Boston Tea Party going on. Right? It's London versus Boston. Oh, hell yeah. It's totally, totally. I mean, Constitution Day was just, like, earlier this week, so there you go. All right, so let's see. Let me mark down who we have here. What are your guys' thoughts on the screen, on what's on the screen, I should say? I remember when S.O. Dino said he about to get flamed by uh, Frenzy for losing. I'm like, well, that's nice. <laughs> I haven't won a single game yet. Does anyone have any non-spoilery comments? Yeah, fam. <laughs> I don't know. I'm talking about the one he'd have with me. I'm not talking about him. If Coco is the right set, uh, it shreds uh, London's team. True. Because rem I think it can, like, pack Grass. I'm not sure how much damage yes. that actually does to Quags. Though, but... Yeah, it needs I HP Grass. Quagsire yeah, could probably... Coco basically wins. Quagsire might be able to tank it, but still, Quagsire... It's four times weak to it, though. Yeah. Yeah, no, it, de has, it depends. Like, Actually, never mind. Uh, grass not just... Grass not just Oko's. Oh, Grass not. I forgot about them, that. But... So... Yeah, if Coco's the right set, it could... Potentially win, because T-Bolt, Grass not... HP Ice, and... I Dazzling mean, real should talk? hit everything bar Rotom Heat. Real talk though, if he manages to get rid of Jirachi early on, he basically went straight up. Like, there's going to be a really big problem for this team because he has Rotom, John Fan, uh, Kabalion, and Landhold, which uh, beat it pretty easily. Yeah. Uh, but Sylveon, yeah, Sylveon is a bit of a problem for the uh, SL Dino's team because he has no fairy resist. That's true. true. All right, well, let's see what happened. <laughs> Got Drumpa. We need more fairy resist. Versus Dawn Fan. We need more steel types. We need one. There, now, am I correct? Or did I, am, am I forgetting? No, wait. Am I forgetting? Is there a steel poison type? No. Okay. Steel? No way. If there was, everyone would be all over it. One thing I'm noticing about both teams is uh, the L Lilla Pups seem to have more of a defensive based team, like Drampa kind of being the exception. Mm -hmm. But uh, Dino seems to have both ends of the spectrum in terms of um, special attack and special or physical attack. Mm -hmm. Whereas it looks like um, the Londons are a little bit more special attack oriented with some physical mixed in there. So it kind of looks like it's kind of a mix of tank versus. Dead. Yeah, I mean, around. I mean, you got Pangoro for physical attacks, and then, I mean, oh, Qua man, I mean, Jirachi sucks. is usually physical, but can do either. Quagsire can technically, I don't know. Quagsire's I think that was the biggest misplay SO Dino has ever made this battle so far. <laughs> like he tried to. Wait, wait, let's back it up. He... Oh, Will O Wisp yeah. missed. Yeah, Will O Wisp missed. Yes. He should have gone land up and intimidate, and then you turned out. Oh, he could have handled that better. Uh, I mean, yeah, I also didn't get why he didn't just Earthquake the uh, Drampa instead of eye shotting it, which Dunfan is naturally faster than Drampa. I mean, yeah. so Earthquake would have done more just... damage anyways, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Wait, what's talking speed? It's 50, Drampa's is 36. Uh, yeah, oh. Yeah. You don't have to be fast, okay. you just have to be faster than the other one. I like how, uh, I like how he's being, like, super uh, confident. Like, he went for Skull, which could have burned um, Cavalian, making Yan totally useless. Mm. I don't think right. that was a really confident play, I just think that was a dumb play. It, to be honest, yeah, it kind of was. I think he was trying to make him switch to, um, to Landorus, to be honest. I think that was what he was trying to go for. I don't know why he would swap. I guess he was just though. banking on him not having Earthquake. Yeah. <laughs> Oh man, this is turning. Really yeah, the crit sucked dying. there because I don't think overheat killed. Yeah, the game's turning really quickly on Dino. This sucks.
It looks like his best option is to um, get Hydrogen to sweep something. Or uh, after this top of Coco um, Pangoro fight, if Hydrogen sweep until um, Sylveon, then he might have a chance to take it out with uh, Landorus. But he's not gonna let. He's not gonna leave like anything in on Hydrogen while he has Sylveon <laughs> in the back. Like that would just be really dumb. That is very true. In a Appreciate hypothetical it. scenario. We let Coco go down so early, and now it doesn't matter. I feel like Dino's only chance here at winning is that he gets a couple crit uh, earthquakes. He needs to be like Rock Polish SD Landorus to win this game, and I don't think he is. <laughs> like, from that damage, he's probably Scarf or defensive. And it looks like yeah. he's Scarf, so Rotom just wins. I don't really know. Oh, I don't like. He wanted the uh, leftovers. I was like, how do we go for protect here? For leftover damage. Of course. Leftover HP. I don't know why he hyper voiced there instead of wishing. That could, um. If High Dragon has the appropriate coverage or it's not like Choice Locked, it could win. Yeah, that thing is carrying uh, Flash Cannon or something. It could turn around. Yeah, no, was, I, 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 I like think that's Dino. Yeah, he, he lost here. Yeah. Like, judging. Oh, no, no. <laughs> he, he, Judging by his moveset and just by the way he's hit, I think he's choice yeah. locked without like. I uh, think at this point he's just. Uh, yeah. I think he's just pouring salt. On, he's, just, he's just pouring salt on the wound. On the wound. There's no. No point. There we go. Alrighty. So looks like London Lollipop's defense won out. This match he goes to the London the Lollipops. Oh man. Alright, let's put this on replay while I do the numbers. <laughs> I don't know how to pretty clear game plan, but something went wrong along the way. Yeah. Well, everything went, went wrong. Meanwhile, Max is over here changing his, uh, <laughs> trainer picture, like, every, every other, uh, every other move. Yeah. I think SL Dino could have just built a little bit better, like, I think he's using a lot of the same sets each week instead of really, like, putting much thought into what he could be bringing and what is most optimal for the week. Yeah. And instead he just... He just runs the same set each week. Like, he could have easily had, um... a better setup on High Dragon being Life for Flash Cannon. And then, like, like maybe... Maybe run SD... if he really wanted to. Yeah, Swords Dance Landorus... Like, Double Dance Landorus tore that team apart. Like, if he was... Oh, yeah, if he did Swords that Dance, early Rock on... Polish, and then Edgequake coverage, he pretty, pretty much just won. Oh, yeah. Lando and then just like, this game. yeah, like if you just took down Quag, then Lando could have won pretty easily. But he was a scarf set, so Sylveon always beat it, Rotom always beat it, Quag always beat it. But uh, the scarf Pangoro, though, that's pretty interesting. Was it scarf? I mean, I, I remember it like out beating the uh, Coco. I was like, how? I don't think it did because it underspent the Rotom, didn't it? Yeah. And I'm like. How is this working out? This man must be Scarf. Like, Pangoro oh, has a speech gonna, like, that gonna, can gonna open it. Scarf, I think. I, I believe it was Scarf. It's I like, scarf. either Dino is running zero speed, or this Pangoro is, is Scarf. Well, the London Lillipups get a 3-0. and 3-0? Oh. Oh. Yeah, they're at 3-1. and one. With plus five points for the season. KOs for this match. Two for Sylveon. One for Rotom Heat. Two for Pangaro. One for Drampa. The current MVP. I believe the MVP of still the entire league so far. With nine KOs is Pangoro the Dragon Warrior. I'm rewatching it. Pangoro did not have Yeah, Pangoro wasn't fit on the split of Rotom. Hmm. It, it didn't have what item it was. Coco it could have been, like, been like a black belt or something. Yeah. 
And let's see, the Boston Basculins. More like a Lumberry. Boston Basculins, minus three. Uh, one KO for Landorus, one KO for Hydreigon, one for Cobalion. Sitting at two and two with zero points. The MVP currently is Cobalion with seven KOs for the season. Alrighty. If we're done here, we're ready to move on to the next, the fifth match that we have on here.